Situated in the heart of the CBD of Cape Town is the Cape Castle of Good Hope, a building where history was made and legacies were cemented. It is the oldest colonial building in South Africa and it was built in the 17th century by the Dutch East India Company. Today, about 348 years later, the castle is a South African heritage site, a military base and a tourism site as well. We spoke to Rihanna Begg, who works for the Castle Control Board, and she has told us more about the history of the castle and about the day-to-day -day acts offered by the ancient building in its change of capacity. Castle Control Board, whereby we manage the site. It is a military site, um, so we have a working military that actually works here on a daily basis and they basically assist us in looking after the space. Um, we basically have um, tours that happen daily at 11, 12 and 2 each day, Monday to Friday. Um, all of that tours, they are free to the public, so basically we need to do is pay the entrance fee. Um, the entrance fee for adults is 30 rand, children 15, and students and pensioners 15 as well. But some days we have a discounted check of 25 rand per adult and 10 rand per child pensioner student. Um, we usually take on many school groups um, that come 9 o'clock in the morning for a tour. Um, they are pre booked tours and we offer them a discounted check. Um, because the castle is a public entity, we need to assist in creating public access from various communities to the castle because at the castle we believe that we need to take the castle to the people and bring them to the castle. <laughs> The Castle of Goodo provides the citizens and tourists an opportunity to visit the castles at a minimum fee. Tours are at 11, 12 and 2 during weekdays and Sundays. School groups are also welcome on a pre-booked tour which will take place at 9am weekdays. <laughs> 